God uses ordinary people to carry out extraordinary tasks. We've been talking about that this week and today I want us to think about Joseph. Remember he was the 11th of 12 sons. So he wasn't the firstborn, he wasn't even the secondborn. He was 11 out of 12. He was insignificant. And yet as he, as he was growing up, he dreamed that he was going to rule over his 12 brothers. Now, he wasn't quiet about it. He was kind of a snot, but he believed that God had given him a dream for a reason. His life wasn't easy. He had to be sold into slavery. And then he was abused by his mistress. He spent time in prison and then suddenly Almost overnight, he became Pharaoh's second in command. And before you knew it, there was Joseph in charge of his brothers. Why? Because God chose an ordinary young man in Joseph to carry out his extraordinary purpose of bringing the Israelites out of a land that was in starvation into a land that had plenty in Egypt. What is God asking you to do? What are your gifts? How is your ordinariness going to be used for God in extraordinary ways?